position of the hex squad. Use uh, power rack or door knob or anything similar to watch yourself. Put your heels together. Turn your feet out approximately 45 degrees. Grab the power rack and pull yourself down into the hole. Open up your knees. Try side to side a little bit and then just stand up. Couple of important points. First, use strength to get to the bottom position. It's number one. Number two, keep your chest big, open up your collarbones. And imagine there is a cable attached to your belly button pulling you straight up. Make space in your hips, find the comfortable position and get up. Again, you may adjust your turn out a little bit and down. Pull your hips out of the socket, make a tall spine, big chest, belly button up and lengthen this side. Bow your knees. Before we tackle a kettlebell hex squat, we will learn how to perform a bodyweight hex squat properly. Russian lion George Hakerschmidt recommends uh, three different variations. So, heels close together, almost uh, touching. Turn out your feet and position number one will be with the arms to the side. Pull yourself down, stay straight and up. Number two. Hands forward, again, down and up. Number three, overhead, down and up. Face the wall squat version, please observe. First of all, you can't really lean forward, otherwise you hit the wall. So that's number one. Number two, it helps you to open up your knees to the side, to open up your hips. Third, try to make a big chest, proud chest. Point your belly button up, lengthen the collarbone. So, not like this. Please observe one more time. That's the face the wall hex squat.